I arrived in Arcata, Northern California, in the late 1970s, and I was struck by the beauty of the ancient redwoods, the rivers, and the ocean. This experience has stayed with me and has fueled my intense passion for finding the most musical and ethically sourced rosewood. It's also been my inspiration for designing and building all of our instruments. This is a foundation of marimba one. My first exposure to marimba was at a festival up in Oregon. As soon as I heard it, I really fell in love with the sound of it. And when I came back to Humboldt County and returned to school at Humboldt State University, I decided to start studying marimba. I wanted to purchase a marimba, and when I priced them out, I realized I could not afford to buy one. So I decided I'd go ahead and build one. I'd never really built anything else before in my life of any complexity. And to me, it looked simple. To me, it was just a bunch of wood and tubes. And I spent about a year building my first marimba, and that first marimba came out so bad that I realized I had to build another marimba. And I just kept doing it, knowing in my mind what I believed would be a really good sound. And over time, after doing it enough, I realized that I could put it all together and start making uh, great instruments. The design of all our instruments, everything we do is inspired entirely by the musicians with whom we work. The musicians, they tell us how they want the instruments to sound, how they want it to function, what they want, what they don't want. It's our job to take the input from musicians to design and build instruments that serve them. That's what our job really is here at Marimba One. Marimba One's always been noted for quality of sound and we try and match that quality of sound with the quality of the parts themselves. We also try and emphasize user friendliness and intuitive operation and assembly of our products. Everything you see here, we've designed up ourselves and it's been a combination of my engineers and myself. I always like to play a really close part in that just because I'm so interested and engaged in it all. These are all hand assembled. Uh, we do design up all these parts, but really when it comes down to it, these are really handmade instruments because you can see, walk through our shop, and you can see people individually tuning the bars, tuning the resonators by hand, putting the frames together, making sure the mechanisms work correctly. It's like a happy marriage of industrial design with hand craftsmanship. Our mallet system, we developed about 12 years ago. The idea is that we wanted to make super great mallets that complement our instruments. We able to control these mallets to such a degree so that we can design all these different mallets. They give you all sorts of acoustic options on the marimba and vibraphone. We're really doing everything we can to make these instruments great instruments. And uh, it really feels like we're doing that and we love doing it.